fear because it doesn't seem like you guys had a fear, even though it seems like the time at the stakes were greater back then. Right. And I could be wrong, but it seemed like the stakes were greater back then to speak out against racism. Right. But you guys, you guys weren't scared of that. Yeah, well, that's the, that's the problem. It's not just the athletes; it's the society as a whole. You right. know, it's the fear factor. You know, I'm fearful that I might lose my job, or I'm fearful that this might not happen, or I'm fearful I might not be able to move into that neighborhood. But you have to realize that everyone that's in history, everyone that's done everything in relative to uh, social justice, all of them had to confront fear. Mm -hmm. You know, you think that Rosa Parks didn't have fear when she sat in that seat on the bus? Right. Or you think Paul Robinson didn't have fear when they told him they was going to take his passport away from him? Uh, you think they didn't have fear when Muhammad Ali, they told him they would strip him of his title where he wouldn't be able to make a living? All of these things are put upon us. That, you know, Tommy Smith, John Carlos, we had fear in Mexico City based on what was uh, surrounding us at that particular time. But you had to break out of that fear and do what's right because it's not about the fear that you had. You try to uh, raise the oppression of fear amongst your peers, your kids, their kids, and so on down the line right. to distinguish that that fear to wipe it out right so okay so with that said then for somebody like myself who's you know in a in a younger generation with the generation coming up now under us how can we how do you think we can um break that cycle of fear well you know do show and tell right you know just like you stated about muhammad ali or you stated about john Carlos or whomever paul robeson <laughs> rosa parks just the mere fact that we have many more individuals stepping up now opposed to what we had in the last 45 years. Right. So when you see the young individuals out of Missouri, uh, you see the young individuals out of uh, uh, out of uh, the, the Los, uh, St. Louis Rams, or you see individuals such as uh, Beyonce, mm -hmm. the base statements that she made at the uh, Super Bowl. Uh, these individuals are showing that it's not about the fair it's about doing what's right. Yeah, you're going to be criticized whether you do the right thing or whether you do the wrong thing. So you might as well realize that it's the proper thing to do is what's right. Right.